good evening all we will try to see some interesting fruits in radiology that is fruit inspired science in radiology so these are the different fruits we will try to see in radiology so this is the first case where you can see uh, this is hyper intense this is the t2 weighted image showing the prostate and there are multiple hypo intense linear striations or linear hypo intense areas noted in the prostate which mimics the typical skin of the watermelon so this is called as watermelon skin sign which refers to diffuse radiating streaky hypo intense areas in prostate on t2 weighted images typically seen in prostatic tuberculosis so remember watermelon skin sign in prostatic tuberculosis next one this is classically strawberry skull here you can see this is classically strawberry skull is seen in case of trisomy 18 or redward syndrome where there is flattening of the occiput which is due to hypoplasia of the occipital bones brainstem and cerebellum and even pointing of the frontal bones which is due to hypoplasia of the frontal bones this flattening of the occiput with pointing of the frontal bones typically mimics the strawberry so that's why it is called as strawberry skull so remember strawberry skull in trisomy 18 or redward syndrome and other you can also remember strawberry gallbladder seen in gallbladder cholesterolosis next one typical this is apple core sign here you can see there is a disease double contrast uh, barium anemia typically showing a annular constricting lesion which is showing luminal narrowing and also here you can see this is the annular constricting lesion in the colon which typically mimics the apple core so this is remember apple core sign which is nothing but napkin ring sign which is most frequently associated with constriction of the lumen of the colon by stenoting stenosing annular colorectal carcinoma next case here you can see pear shaped pear shaped bladder so this is nothing but pear shaped bladder so this is nothing but pear shaped bladder is classically seen in case of uh, uh, any condition where the bladder is completely con uh, compressed and the shape of the bladder is mimicking the pear shape so this pear shaped bladder is due to compression of the bladder by fluid blood lymphocytes or extra visited urine sometimes due to excessive pelvic lipomatosis can also compress the bladder and even vascular dilatation lymph nodal enlargement and even sometimes bilateral psoas enlargement here in this case you can see bilateral psoas enlargement is also causing the compression of the bladder and the bladder take the shape of a pear resembling a pear that's why it is called pear shaped bladder remember other appearances pear shaped appearance which can be also seen in case of appendicular mucosal this is a case of appendicular mucosal where you can see pear shaped appearance or drumstick appearance next case uh, here you can see uh, this is nothing but called as banana sign or lemon sign here you can see normal buttock shaped configuration of the cerebellum is lost and the cerebellum is typically wrapped around the uh, wrapped wrapped around with loss of uh, or obliteration of the cisterna magna resembling the banana so this whenever the brainstem is completely compressed uh, cerebellum is completely wrapped tightly around the brainstem due to spinal cord tethering or downward migration of the postophosa contents typically seen in case of carry to malformation so whenever you normal buttock shaped configuration of the cerebellum is lost and the cerebellum mimics a banana and also there is constriction or indentation of the frontal bones which makes the lemon sign definitely they trace the wall of the spine for any spina bifida or meningocele or minor meningocele uh, to confirm the diagnosis of carry to malformation so remember banana sign and lemon sign in case of carry to malformation next case this is typically known as banana peel appearance this is longitudinal section of the iota where you can see the both the renal arteries this both the renal arteries origin from the uh, iota typically mimics a peeled banana so that's why it is called as banana peel sign next case this is also known as banana fractures these banana fractures are typically nothing but they are complete fractures horizontally oriented pathological fractures typically seen in case of paget's disease this is that uh, fracture you can clearly see this is that fracture and this is that uh, fracture this is completely resembles a broken banana so whenever we cut a banana that these fractures resemble that cut banana so this banana fracture is nothing but complete horizontally oriented pathological fracture seen in deformed bones typically in case of pager's disease so remember banana fracture in pager's disease next uh, this is classical bunch of grapes appearance or bunch of grapes sign here you can there is, see there are multiple cystic foci noted within the uterus this was where the case this case was a upt positive so this was a complete molar pregnancy where you can see multiple cystic foci scattered in throughout the endometrial cavity uh, this mimics bunch of grapes appearance or bunch of grapes sign so this is classically seen in hydatiform mole and also it can be also seen in hepatic abscesses botryoid rhabdomyosarcoma bronchiectasis intracanal tubercloma intraosseous hemangiomas 
uh, intraductal papillary mucinous neoplasm and multicystic dysplastic kidney so where in all these conditions you can see bunch of grapes sign that's why it is called as bunch of grapes sign disambiguation so these are all the uh, fruit signs which we have discussed today thank you all